Blimey. What busy lives we have for a pair of nine-year-olds. I know. My niece is sure to want my attention soon. Uncle Roscoe, can you come and play with me? Not right now, Jane. Lily and I are talking. If you don't come now, I will tell on you. No, you most certainly won't. That's naughty, Jane. You don't tell tales, that's a very nasty thing to do. Unless Roscoe was doing something dangerous, which he isn't, so you do not go and make up a nasty story about him. What's going on in here? Uncle Roscoe won't play with me. Jane Jessica Barrett. How dare you tell tales on your uncle? You have upset him, and that is very very naughty. I explained to you about how bad it is to tell tales for no reason. You would have done well to listen. You naughty girl. Apologize to him right now, or I will put you straight to bed. Well, don't just stand there. Say you're sorry right now. Or bed. Naughty girl. I haven't done anything wrong. Right. That's it. I am taking you upstairs and you are going to bed. You are a very naughty girl. Roscoe, is there anything I can do to cheer you up? Thanks Lily, but I'm going to my mom and dad. I hate seeing anyone upset, but I hate being angry even more. Oh dear. I thought I heard crying. Lily, what's got you so upset, sweet cousin? Oh Grace, I've just been angry with Jane for telling tales on Roscoe. It has ripped me apart inside. Oh you poor poor thing. Come here, we need to cheer you up. Oh no, my poor baby. What's got you in this state? I was just angry with Jane for telling tales on her own uncle. It has just broken my heart, Grace. I think you'd better leave this to me. It could take ages to calm her down. Lily honey, come with me, and I'll see if I can put a fresh smile on your sweet little face. I hope Aunt Lily can cheer her sweet little daughter up. Grace. What's wrong? Why are you so down? I just feel really bad for little Lily at the moment. She's had a hard time today. I heard about that, but worry not. She's taken her to see Olivia. That will definitely cheer her up. Olivia's usually the only one who can cheer the little sweetheart up. And we don't want to show her a sea of sad faces when she gets back. Because it'll set her off again. Wouldn't it be better to just forget about it? Millie's right. Let's not even think about it anymore. She always knows just the right things to do, does my daughter.